Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I'm going to uh, continue on from the stuff I started yesterday for Get Your Chic On for Rachel and Bella uh, being a part of her design team for May. Um, my mind's a little, also a little occupied, too. Last night, shouldn't have been doing it at, oh, I think it was one, one, 1 in the morning. My C drive got full, and I went in to delete my temporary files and my hit browser history and all that. I didn't see that my download file was checked until I hit clean and then I seen the check mark in the download file. So every digital I ever created, every picture that I have searched for, everything gone. So it was an unrest, not a very restful night because, of course, I stressed over it, of course. And then I just, I worried myself sick. And now I've tried four different programs, trying to recover them. My friend upstairs, who I rent the basement from, he came down because he's a computer program. He said, let's try this one, see if we can recover them all. The, a lot of it is, I mean, yes, I'm sad that I lost some of my digitals I created. I can create again. Um, some of it was saved in the actual program I use, but that program only allows us so much and then it starts deleting things. So I don't have older ones. Um, and even my Dropbox got emptied and I have pictures from my family trips to Disney World that I don't have anywhere else. I'm just like, eh. so I'm hoping that this will work and save me <laughs> somehow. So yesterday we had several, I started several things. I'm hoping I have a little bit of creativity, even though this is like weighing heavy on my mind. Like I said, it's not even just the digitals. It's the, like when I look for things, I, I, I trace back the picture to make sure it doesn't own to an Etsy shop or whatever. I make sure that it's, uh, especially the like the vintage Im images, even some of the vintage wallpaper. I really go and search to all possibility um, to make sure I can use it. So like my graphic fairies, I don't have to worry. I can find that stuff easily. When I was doing a little tidying yesterday, I found this little bag. I It's a tea bag. And I had made this cluster on it, and I was like, oh, it's perfect. And then I was going through sending some happy mail, and I saw this sticker, and I thought, this fits it perfectly. So then I thought, well, maybe this will fit perfectly just on this cluster. Don't know where I'll use this in the journal, but I still, I thought, well, that's nice and simple. An easy little thing done. It can fit a little... I mean, this is not a tag, obviously, I would want to make it taller, but at least I know that it has to be this width, and I can can be a little decorative pocket, right? So I can make a little, <coughs> I have a, I'm a Scentsy seller, but I also have, I turned on one of my Scentsy's to, I love the smell of it, but I got a new one, and I put it in, <coughs> and it's so strong, it's choking me, but I removed it. But, of course, it still lingers for a bit. And so it's got me... <clears throat> I can almost taste it. And I've got a new one in, so I'm hoping as it melts and starts to burn more. So we have that done. So that's a e nice one we can make a tag for. And in it, this, I would probably do a nice long tag. But then I was thinking, remember that pocket? Like, this is why I put it over here because there was one in here I didn't want to hide the image on this one so I thought this might look cute just down in the corner here so that's why I did that because I thought it was perfect now I'm thinking and I don't think I have any very narrow lace I was thinking to trim this along with lace but I can mean I can put the pocket in and go from there and that could be a double pocketed if uh, a double pocket if I want it to I could just do I could do it this way and also have where I could put something to the side like this I thought might be cute too instead of all the same 
So I think that's how I'm going to do it. So I'm going to just kind of glue this down and put it in there as a decision made out of something. I don't even know when I did that cluster on that tea bag. It was just, I was going through my ready-made pockets. I have a, a loaded pocket swap and I wanted to see what I had in pockets done. And I actually found a pocket already with lots of lovely stuff in it. So I want to, I got to let this glue. You know, sometimes I squeeze the glue bottle so so much so hard that my thumb starts to hurt. Ooh. So how is everybody today? I, other than that, I'm also feeling a little stressed because I spent so much time now trying to recover these files. I'm behind in my packing. I got to throw a load of laundry in. Um, I want to print a few more things to take with me. Um, that was what I was trying to do last night up at that hour of the morning was print some things so I could make some packages while I'm at home sitting in around the TV. Me and my mom, I think, are going to spend some time up in the trailer. Oh, no, I glued it the wrong way. I always do that. So let's do this. And I don't worry. If I do something silly like that, you can also take a thin piece of paper and cover that over. It's not going to hurt anything. I might take this one right here. Boo-boos and mistakes happen uh, no matter how many years or if you're a newbie or if you've been doing it for a long time. I'm not a newbie, but I wouldn't say I'm a pro either. I think I'm into my third year of doing this. And my first year I was so lost and my skills, you know. So what I'm just going to do is I'll do that. <laughs> Nobody's going to see it. Just make sure. Oop, and now I dropped it there because it's just the way this day is going to go. And it started at one in the morning last night. <laughs> um, so I'm going to, so I wanted to print off some stuff. I'm taking my big fussy cut folder with me, as I told you guys yesterday, um, because me and my mom will be up at the trailer. And sometimes at night what we do, we just watch TV and so I can sit there and cut and get some things caught up. Even during the day, we're sitting out on the deck um, and I can do the same thing, just sit there and fussy cut, enjoying the beautiful spring weather up at the, tra at the trailer at the lake. It's a beautiful, beautiful place. My sister's had a trailer there, I wanna say over 25 years. Um, and my mom had hers and then my sister uh, separated from her husband and that trailer sold but my mom had bought had already bought one so now it's kind of the family trailer there's two trailers actually on it it's a big trailer that my sister and her husband and her son are in and then my mom and me have a little pop-up trailer to the back um, well my mom does and I when I go I stay in there with her she has one side for her one side for me and she sets it up and we watch tv in there together my sister's one of those people who run around the trailer park visiting everybody because she's a very social butterfly. I am to a point, but I don't know the people as well as my sister does because she's up there every weekend from the time the trailer opens to the trailer closes. Whereas I, I'm lucky if I get to spend a week up there. Usually in the summer I spend uh, about 10 days up there and then I sometimes get one week long weekend in. Um, so I don't know the people as well as her. I do know some of them, some of them, but she's much more social and she likes to run from trailer to trailer, have a drink here, drink there. That's not me. And it's her and her husband. I, I, you know, I can't tag along for everything with them. I'm already sometimes when I'm home visiting a real third wheel for them. So I'm going to end up putting, turning this into a pocket on the side and a pocket to the top so that and that way that it's so beautiful and you know I'm noticing in some places I might still do a little ink but I don't want to I want to try doing a journal without inking it to death so that's what we're gonna do <coughs> mm, 
I'm going to choke all day. Hopefully it'll clear soon. Okay. So did I know, now that it's glued, I know that the width of it is going to change. So I'm just, oh, not in the inside though, only on the, there. I might want to, before I play around with that pocket, just let it sit for a bit. So I'm going to just try that again. Yeah, so that's a little wide, and I think this is a little narrow, but I still think it'll be perfect for not sliding. So at least I know the width of what I want to go for a tag. So I'm just seeing if I have, <coughs> excuse me, I'm going to, because that's bothering my throat, I feel like I'm losing my voice. So I have these, these are like collaged on the back of a page, and sometimes I'm just seeing what I can maybe use out of these that is, okay, some of those are, this might be, where's my width thing? So this is a little wide. That's almost the perfect size, but it might be too long. Well, not might be, it will be. And it definitely has to be more sturdy because that pocket the way it is. Just seeing if any of these I can add. Well, then I've got this. I, I really say excuse me if I continue to cough like this. I do apologize for it. I thought it had cleared enough up before I turned on. I think but this is a little... So I'm not going to worry about that. But here, I'm just seeing something. So I'm going to have to move this for a second. This is like, oh, I know a lot of the ladies that do some of this, they do where they have it all set up and all the pieces ready. So I'm more of a craft along with me, think with me. And as you can see, not always well organized or my thoughts are everywhere. That's the type of, the, that's the way I am. <laughs> Let's just put it that way. And in everything I create. And sometimes it's bad because I, I jump to another project because... I see something new I want to try. Get those little wobblies off. And so, so I'm looking forward to going home. I just, um, I sometimes I miss um, having my craft space, my craft room. But I do enjoy the time with my family. You know, it's, you know, this is definitely a favorite thing. And I can't make videos there. And I miss my YouTube, doing my YouTube videos a lot. I just can't carry everything I need in my suitcase with the weight. It's bad enough even with what I take. And that nowadays the weight is so low. I mean, my suitcase won't even be full, full. And I'm already gone over the weight limit because <clears throat> they don't allow a lot. So it's times when I wished I did drive. I just want to see how long. Where's my ruler? I didn't bring my pencil, but just slide backwards and see. Okay, it's at 74%. Let's hope it finds my files. Oh, right there. But there's one thing I need to do to my pencil because I like a sharp pencil. I love a sharp pencil. Oh, 
Okay, so whereabouts do I want this to stop? I think I'm going to go right about here. <clears throat> right about there. And it's okay because this again can be used as another tag. So they won't they won't go to waste by any means. And then I was going through my pockets and I found this that kind of had already started but not finished. So I was like, oh that's okay. I can use that and to have it's another option for a pocket if I want. So I just put it there. Just in case. Because when I was going through things, and those are the things I've already have that are ready to go in pockets. Oh, one of my hairs. And I'll just keep hoping I'm in keeping this in. Yeah. How many minutes have I wasted so far? 16 minutes? Boy, oh boy. But we did get a pocket glued in. We did get a pocket glued in. And if I wanted to, I could add a little word there, um, easy enough, if I can find my nice Rachel and Bella words. I used them on another project last night. It's just a matter of where I put it last night. Here it is. You never, never know. I'm going to put the word pause because you know in life sometimes we're so busy we just don't stop and take in what's around us. Um, it drives my mom crazy because when me and my sister are out, like we like to go for walks and we take tons of pictures and we'll play around in a scenery area and do different things and at different views and we pause and we look and I, I love taking in what's around me especially when I'm in out in on the beach walking along the shore <clears throat> me and my sister sometimes we one day randomly it was a while ago it was when I wasn't having such a hard time walking I'm just thinking I could put a little word in here here comes boo boo she was laying upstairs by the window in the sun and now she thinks she's going to get food. There's no food, baby. Yeah, I think I, that... And look, it's perfect. Love it when things come together that are just little random things you find. Okay, I know I brought it over. Oh. I lied, it's here. I haven't seen my download files there. There we go. Get my little dabber. And just do the edges a little to take away some of that white. That I think is a perfect addition to it. Oh. What is that? So maybe we're going to put that there. Because of what's there. I don't know what that is. Or do we, where are they? I buried them. They are here, they are here. Or do we put a cute little flower there and then the word pause down here. Perfect. That is what we shall do because I really like this word down in this corner. And then you'll notice with me, I don't use these really round bulky beads. Um, I don't like a lot of, I put so much bulk in my journals that that I some, I need to take a little something somewhere and I find it leaves indents on the paper. So a lot of times I'll do that and I just got to grab my beads from over here. I, I get my flat top ones out. It's one of the things I have to do when I'm in Ontario is hit some Dollaramas looking for some of these. These are the best beads I found in the, uh, not Dollarama, Dollar Tree. And um, I we drive, drive 45 minutes to Dollar Tree and when I went they didn't have any light pink. And I really like the light pink.
Oh, Pika's here too, so you might get her butt in a few minutes, guys. You know Pika. <laughs> she has to make her viewing. There we go. There. I like that. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay, back to the what we're going to put in that pocket. Let's grab... We have a couple longer papers here. We have this beautiful one here. I really like this one. And I don't want much of the words in it because I really, I just, this digital is just the color choices she used, the flowers, everything about this is just beautiful. And I'm just going to ink this whole thing. My friend, because he knows I'm having a hard time finding good clue sticks, he was out Canadian Tire, and that was a two-pack like that, and he brought it and goes, maybe this one will work. thought it was really nice. When he, he has had a hard time thinking of this being a business to start, um, he just doesn't understand it, right? Um, it's different for him. Even my family. My sister, not so much. Um, because my sister's really good at supporting me in a lot of things. Um, she's really good about it. Um, and, and like I talked to my aunt about it, I said that it's something, instead of doing nothing right now, at least I'm trying something. And that's how I look at it. Um, and not always, and it helps with me not being... Oh, poor me, poor me, you know. So, I think my family's a little bit. And even my aunt was like, oh, you're on YouTube. And, I, and I'm like, Aunt Cheryl, it's not going to be really something you watch. She goes, yeah, but, you know, I, I'll support you in any way. So, I have, uh, I have a really good family. Me and my aunt on Sunday night, we were... Normally, we'll call each other, and she she's in bed at the latest 11, sometimes early, earlier than that. And we stayed up to almost 2 in the morning talking, and we didn't even realize we were, had it gotten that late so quickly. <laughs> so, and uh, she's like, oh, the next, she makes her big meal for the afternoon. And she's like, I was planning on making scalloped potatoes and ham for lunch tomorrow. I don't know if I'll be up to it. And then she sent me a message and the next day and said, you know, I don't regret staying up that late. And I did get my scalloped potatoes and ham. And she was like, if you live closer, I would invite you for dinner. And ham and scalloped potatoes happens to be my one of my favorite meals growing up that my mom used to make. My aunt makes it just as good as my mom. They're sisters. Um, and uh, so, yes, I am inking this a little bit, guys. I, I must have a little something ink because there's so much of the same color on this page. So I thought this might need a little inking. And then I'm hoping I can find some cute little butterflies to go on this. It doesn't need a lot at all. I'm going to take this. The, this I love. And I know on Amazon here in Canada, I think they sell for $10 or more thing and we were at we have these things called bin stores where now it's now a business where people buy the Amazon return bins and that um and my sister saw that and she grabbed it oh Pika and Boo Boo what are you doing babies they're trying to get in my suitcase they're they do not like when I go away so I that's why I don't pack early it's so that I don't have the suitcase out for so long where it causes anxiety before I have to. But now I'm at that point where I want to start putting some things in there. I'm hoping I made that long enough. Um, my hole punch. Oh, wait, I got to put the back backing on this. Oh, I don't think I brought backing. Let me, oh, just 
touch over here. Now, I made a big boo-boo on this. I wanted this printed on, on both sides, and I forgot I put it in my printer, and I printed something dark on it. But I'm still going to use it, except for that corner I got some black ink on it. So I'm still using it. And I don't think it'll show too much through, I don't think. You know, you don't waste your papers. And it's not much that, I mean, I'm not doing any purple right now or that would go nicely in a purple journal. I was seeing if it, I print on music paper and, and book pages and it's too dark for that. Um, part of that was trying to see if that would work. Before I punch my hole, I want to get the back on it. So we found that at the bin stores. And then, believe it or not, we're at a bin store, and these on Amazon, I think they're about $15 here in Canada. Um, and I, I picked it up, and I said to the guy, because he had a, a thing on every item, $10. And I knew, you know, I said, what do you want for this? And he knows my, he, my sister, he's the one in Guelph, and he knows my sister really well. He goes, you can have it for two bucks. I was like, it's mine. And I thought these are perfect for when I travel. The small ones, I can just put it in a, um, a case and I'll have them. And the great thing is right now, I don't have black soot. And it's got, and I've never, I don't think I have antique linen. These are my two favorites. So I got two more. So it's, a, and I like those little ones because it's a good way to test out if it's something you actually like so there we go put that back over there well if you could see boo boo right now she is too funny you might see my pile of dirt. I started, I'm going to show you her. I'm going to slowly move you guys. That's my boo-boo. Say hi, boo-boo. <laughs> That's how she's laying. Now let me put you back in place. Pika's in my suitcase. That's why she's not come to bother me. And now, you know what? I had that perfectly centered. And now I probably don't anymore. Oh, maybe yeah that's my boo-boo she's my my tubby cat and she likes to lay like that <laughs> so she's hoping I'll feed her again but she doesn't know that she's not getting fed again she'll have her afternoon snack around three o'clock when Jacob comes home she usually gets up for between Three and three thirty for afternoon. I I feed her in small amounts. I know most people only feed them day and night, but if I give her a full meal, she'll eat it too quickly. Uh, she doesn't know how to slow it, so I give her small, tiny portions through the day. Just because it's the way I can help lessen her throwing up. Um, I had to, I never used to give my cat soft, soft food, but the more I read up on it, um, I learned that it's actually better for them than all hard food because it's so deep. Hard food is so dehydrated that there's not much water. And most cats aren't natural water drinkers because they get their um, hydration from the food they catch out in the wild from, you know. And so I put them back onto a soft food diet. And she doesn't like, she doesn't drink a lot of water like her sister does. So, and I know that because I have a cup on, I have my glass of water and they have their glass of water on my desk. Um, I started that because I wanted to see how much water they were drinking. I'm almost wondering if this is too big for here. And maybe go with something like this. But that, I mean, that can easily go 
on this tag too. Now a lot of times I staple, but when it's really flimsy like this, I find that doesn't staple well. So I'm gonna actually hole punch both of these and we'll, I'm gonna hole punch this one. Glasses down, try to get the middle as much as possible. Ugh. There we go. I think I have some reinforcements here. And I've tried a water fountain. I should set up the water fountain. I'm going to try the water fountain again. He says he, he's good at doing their water, but I don't think he's as good as me with water. They get fresh water morning and night in my cup, in their cup. And so I might put the fountain in after I turn on the fountain and give the fountain one more whirl. At least I know if it's going while I'm gone there's they might use it so oh, that was a little more off center i should have went to the back because at the front it looks centered at the back it doesn't oh well so i'm going to use this on here and i could go through the other way but i'm going to tie it that's what I'm going to do. Oh, I should keep that in camera. It's just, I don't always put my glasses down so I move it closer so I can see it. And that's all I'm going to do. There we go. She's done. She's ready to go in something. I think she's going to end up in the back of that when we find where we're going to put that pocket. And in this one, I'm thinking instead of lace, I might stick I'm just sometimes I do this stick her in there and see what she'll look like yeah that's and if I want it to add a little more fluff to her I'm gonna actually see if I can get I'm gonna take my glasses out I may not be able to I might put a second staple in it maybe not I won't add any more to it and if you don't like the staples showing, um, I'll show you what I sometimes do with them. I'm just thinking, really, I wanted a little bit more on her. Let's take that, that off. Yeah, I like that, but I'll just glue it. I need butterflies. Where are my pink butterflies? Is that pink? Yep. Yeah. That was easy to find. It's usually not that easy to find. So first I'm gonna put a little glue there. Good, the good thing is some of that smell is going away. And see on this side, what I might do, so that doesn't look so boring on the other side, did I put them? Oh boy. Let's take put a pearl there. There we go. And then a couple of things I do. Sometimes I'll just put one of these hearts here. I could put a flower here if I wanted to. I need to buy some more of these pink flowers because I'm starting to get low on them, especially. Do I want pink? White is too white. Cream is too cream. <laughs> okay, green is too green. Okay, there we go. Oh, I think Boo Boo has 
finally decided to crawl up in bed and go to sleep. Usually I'll put her up in the bed. I'll put her up in my bed and sometimes I'll throw down one of my uh, older sh old shirts that I just wear around the house because she likes to sleep on things up or a bag if I have a bag handy and then she'll calm down quicker. Come on. And you know, a lot of times, like this is so beautiful on its own. I don't think you have to add a lot to it. Come on. Come on, Glue. Patience. That's enough. The pearls do have sticky, but I take them, it off because I don't find it sticky enough. I learned that when making flowers. I made some flowers last night. And I'm trying to decide if I'm going to sell them. If people would buy them, I'll just show you quickly. I haven't quite finished them up. look at the scan is finished but I'm going to leave it for now till I'm done so these are the flowers I've made and I like I haven't finished them yet but I'm just wondering if I make a couple of big ones and small ones if people would purchase them or not um, sometimes it's hard like I make journals I haven't sold many journals because I haven't completed and I need to do that um, is focus on some journals um, but I love making ephemera. I really, really do. <laughs> um, and maybe I need to make more journals. Okay, let me pull out my butterflies. The ones I was thinking might be nice on this are this one. But it might be too light. Or do I need to go with a darker pink? I think the darker pink blends in too much. I think I like that. Oop, it's caught. He's caught. There we go. There, I'll put a, just a couple of flowers, butterflies on them. I need to cut some more of those small, small ones because I end up using them quite often, the smaller ones. They take a lot of time to cut. Even some of the other butterflies, some of the other butterflies I have, I might turn into smaller and I sometimes I find butterfly I, I always ink them one because to help them stand out more but I just fold it in half so that I can get the sides a little easier without getting too much on the actual butterfly fingers cross that this that my friend found for me works it's handy having a computer programmer as a good friend and so close because he does help me a lot of times and when he has to update his computer he updates my computer because i get his old com stuff from his old computer because he doesn't buy a whole brand new computer he buys the parts and goes inside and rebuilds his computer and so then he takes his older parts and rebuilds my computer so then it's even updated because his computer has to be different than mine because he's a programmer. And uh, so, um, and he he's a gamer and he plays games that are highly graphic. So, and see, if you notice, I don't have the tenons because some of them, they're so tiny that they don't cut out well. So I find I just cut them off and then I take and add them. And I find that works for me. You do what works for you. That's the only thing we can do, right, guys? And I sometimes do it on my bigger ones because I like how it looks. Because I don't like a lot of the white paper showing. Like on this here. Where's my really fine fussy cut scissors? I need to just trim up some of that white off the top. Because it's really bothering me. Hi, 
Pika. Oh, Pika was not in my suitcase. She was upstairs, and she is now here. So she's going to start to cause some mischief, guys, because that's what Pika does. Is it 2.30? It can't be 2.30. Oh, my goodness. It is 2.30. Where did today go? Well, Andre's on his way to get the little one. And how much we're at? Oh, Pika. We're at 40 minutes. Oh, sorry, guys. You want in the window? Let's go. There you go. Let me move my stuff over. Tomorrow night will be a late night. I The night before a trip, when I'm getting on the train, and she knocked my bead. Lucky I noticed that. Silly girl. Get to the window if you're going. And in a minute, she's going to try to get in my basket I have sitting here. <laughs> have to clear her spot. <laughs> Come on, over here. Pika. Over here. Not in the ink pad. The other day, I had my ink pad open, and then I ended up with little kitty cat paws. Don't disturb everything. She's about to knock everything off. Oh, silly girl. Sorry, guys. <laughs> she can be a pain. I wasn't sure if he had to go get Jacob because his mama is coming grocery shopping with us tonight. We usually grocery shop on Fridays, but we're going to do it tonight. I'm going out with dirty, dirty hair because i got to color it. And uh, I let my hair get really dirty when I color it, but I have to go get a hair coloring. <laughs> I should have done that on the weekend if I would have been thinking smart. There we go. Ta -da! And it is done. That's all I'm going to do to it. And we're going to put it in the pocket. And there we go. There we go. And then we just got to put a little something here. Now, I almost thought. To see how wide I can go with this. Sorry, no, I know it can't be that wide. Hey, no, it's so funny when they do it. She kind of hesitates. Should I touch it and knock it over? Is she gonna say something? And then she kind of looks side glances me. No, no, paws off. She's giving me like a evil side glance right now, guys. If you would, could see it. Hmm. I know, I think I want it to stick out like that. And put a nice tab on it. I don't have a tab right now, but... Oh, because I had to move that stuff. Here, we'll put it here. Oh, and one of my little... If I made a little scrappy pad, I could stick... It out the side. A little scrappy pad. I could do that. But because we're not ready to go there, and I said we were going to try to get a couple of things finished, let's see where we can put this. Oh, yes, we were going to, I was going to put this pocket on the front here. So let's get that glued in so we can at least say we have. <coughs> Excuse me. Stop biting plastic. Does anybody have cats that love... This pocket is made out of cereal package. I get my shredded weed in. I folded it up and made it into more pockets. I have more of them. I'm so happy because I like using them. They're nice quality to them. Come on, glue. Come on, come on. I gotta still fix these sides up, but that's I do at the end when I put up some ribbon on it. Stick 
this pocket on. Then I, I feel better if I get a couple things at least put in. Oh, things stick into the... There we go. And this has a lot of space for pockets. We have this one. That'll sit there. Then we have one in the inside, but I'm going to make a journal card for there. Um, oh, speak of the devil, but I, I think I want a bigger journal card because it goes too far down in. This might sit like this. And this is too big here, so we'll use this in a different spot. But this is supposed to be going on that. And I don't think I have a paper clip handy here. Sometimes I paper clip. But this is where, not this one in particular, but a nice scrappy pad, a small, oh, oh, I know. Maybe that there. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if that one is going to go there. I was thinking a small note, not this one, but one that's, we got to, obviously we'll put some more things in there. What other, is that it? Any things we have ready to go? Yeah. Okay. So we know we have that, but the only thing we might do on this Where's our words? There we go. So we got to go grocery shop. I got to stop at the dollar store, grab a hair coloring and some cat food because I got to stock up on the cat food for while I'm gone. Always sometimes trying to find where we're going to put it. I added the butterfly already. Now I might still end up adding a tab on this. You never know. I sometimes go back over. There we go. We'll put that there. Because I think a nice tab. And I haven't made any yet. No, I wasn't sure if I did or not. So we have that partially ready to go. So we need something for that pocket and something for that pocket. So we might do a bigger journal card. But if we put a tab on this, we might end up putting that there with a nice tab is what we might end up doing. But it's so beautiful, I hate hiding it. And then do, so there's several decisions I can make as we go, as we're making more ephemera. So we'll just put that there so it looks pretty. And on this, mm, see that's what I mean? But again, if you're going to write, you could easily take that out so that it doesn't, that's why sometimes those dents in things. Um, probably going to do a little stencil on this. Let's see what I have in a stencil. I have a beautiful rose stencil. Stencil I just got, I thought, but where did I put it? I thought I ordered a. Oh, yep, here it is. And I don't think I'm going to do pink on pink. I think I'm going to do. The rose, I got this from Temu for 99 cents. And it actually is really good plastic. It's not thin. Even in these are not thin. Where's 
let me put the glue on my thing here. Now I'm almost wishing maybe I don't stencil there. And I'll put a little cluster or something on that. And we'll do this. Haha, <laughs> changed my mind. But sometimes you have to watch the corners. I do end up moving. Oh, first thing we got to do, take that out so we can do this better. And then I might just put it in the corners. Maybe not. So you, you can play around with it a bit. And I moved it a bit, so in other places. Sometimes around the edge, I'll do it a little darker and then fade it in. I'm, I'm learning stenciling still, so not always is it perfect. But it look, it's looking good. i got to stop moving it. Are you off to get them? Okay. Jacob is not looking for, he does not like when I leave. So, uh, he, he gets very, he's very attached and there, oh, look how pretty that is. But again, I removed it off there because I want the roses over here more. Because I don't want just that half. So sometimes I play around with my stencil too. So that I... There we go. Just because of the way this one is designed need a little something here and you can do that oh this is so beautiful it's turning out so nicely I'll move it up closer to that's why I don't tape it on because a lot of times I move it so that I get good pattern all over Look at that. I don't know if you guys can see it. How well you can see that. It's just gorgeous. Oh, it turned out so nice. Perfect. So then I'm going to probably end up putting a cluster of some kind, or I might end up with a cluster up there. There we go. And I'm not doing much on this. This a lot of times is where I'll put a bit of, just add in, you can do, is you can almost do a little collage of, of washi tape on it, depending on where you want to put it. It doesn't have to be the full page, you can just, I'm thinking two things I'm, on this, I'm thinking a little washi tape here. Just a little something on it, if you want to add a little bling. And then I'm just thinking... I can never get these open, but I don't know if I have the right color butterfly in here. Then I'm thinking... Glasses on.
that one. I had the pink butterflies I thought left on my desk. Package of it. Did I stick it away? It doesn't have to be pink. We could bring in a little color into this if I want it to. I have this habit sometimes of when I get stuck on a color, I put everything the same. I'm just thinking even a nice... Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> I have the right instinct those green away. I don't put my there they are. I'm trying to decide between that one or popping in and grabbing. Come on. It won't come out. Every time I pick it up it falls out. See, and that's so close to the same color, I don't think it stands out enough. So we'll just stick with, do I have something on this side of pinks that are darker? No. What you got, Pika? Bring it to me. What you got, baby? Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. You got your toy? Yeah? Yeah? You brought me your toy? I like that. So you can take these pages because they could write here and you just add a little... I'm very bad at... I know a lot of people leave their pages very blank and it's probably why journals take me so long is because I like so much... I like, bl I like my pages decorated. And I'm trying hard to leave, but because one of the things too, this is the kind of your first page when you open it. So I kind of, that's what I was thinking. It would look nice with a little something. And again, you can see I don't have the things. There we go. And I like that. And I could even, if I wanted to add more to it, I should really cut these out, but I find it easier to find. Do I have the word journal on here? Thrive, strive, compassion, encouraged. Imagine beauty. No, okay. I don't know if this would be just going one step too far, but we can try it. I think we're probably getting close to the end of the time. He noticed yesterday I kept saying it's close to the end of the time and I kept going. I think we have to say bye now, guys. So thank you for joining me today um, and just kind of doing a craft. I needed to do it to do kind of distract me um, and so I just kind of thinking hmm huh. I'm gonna leave you with this thought guys what do you think should I put a word there I kind of like it maybe not the word relax but I think I like it I'm just gonna leave it there and think about